hello everybody welcome to the video today we are going to be seeing if i can qualify for whatever so i thought i'd hop on the track i've seen other people hop on this way and i thought this was really cool my first lap actually ended up being my best qualifying lap for a few laps or it could have just been the first lap was, was a good one but uh i did want to hit on this if you guys do not want to see a qualifying or two there's two qualifying laps and then there's like a, a funny moment in between the two uh, make sure to skip to about maybe two and a half minutes would be where I'd skip to if you're looking for the racing that has the LCQ in it where I tried to uh, LCQ or, or qualify for the uh, the triple crown here in Arlington so that's what we're uh, the big goal was here tonight was to get into the big uh, the big triple crown race and I already kind of spoiled it I did end up qualifying but it is so so funny uh, when I actually found out I qualified I think it was the funniest genuine reaction <laughs> I've had in a long time um, but yeah this is this is super fun to try and put together some laps this right here was happening like a lot I was on an absolute heater ended up sliding out in that berm this is more understandable than the last one but the berm thing was I mean what the f is that dude that is so stupid. Cut out a curse word or two of that, by the way. But yeah, this is just a voiceover. I don't know. Recording circumstances have been a little different recently, so you guys just have to do with these kind of makeshift videos. This right here is another video of me doing... I think this might be the half heater I had going, where I was going on an absolute heater, and then uh, someone choked me up, if I'm not mistaken. I can't be sure. Uh, I spun so many laps. I didn't even end up heading back to the pits until probably the final five minutes. I was just out there trying to rip, so, uh, yeah, I think this might actually be a good lap, but, um, I wasn't able to really show in qualifying the speed that I had. I actually was able to run a 51.5 in, uh, testing, and, uh, I had some room to improve on that as well. My ideal was a 51.1, so I definitely had some speed here today. I didn't get any of the quads or anything like that, but that was the best qualifying lap I could put in. Oh my god, I made it. How the hell did I make that? I rode like crap. Turns I am. It turns out I'm in an LCQ. So that'd be fun. So I hopped into the LCQ. As you guys couldn't tell, I didn't realize I made it, and I checked it about two minutes past, whatever, because I told Mr. Trojan I didn't make it. We'll see the start here. I was looking pretty solid, and uh, if you guys are wondering why there's no uh, no <laughs> sound, is because my dingly dumb butt accidentally was playing music this whole time so copyright is an issue uh, i was super stupid for going for that i said in the recording why did i go for that in my head and then there's a few incidents here for sure uh right here was one uh absolutely get rammed and then he ended up going down it looked like his he got a poboso physic and absolutely hit me and then this is another pobobo physic that i didn't understand I ended up just rolling the finish line i was it came out dead last in an lcq uh, at this point you are screwed you are not making it and i knew that i was thinking about it crossing right here um i still wanted to get some time in on the game uh didn't know what i was expecting but it definitely wasn't that seeing the rider in my way really caught me off guard and then uh i don't know i mean this guy's uh ping was really really bad but i was faster in the whoops than most of these guys most of the time and I'm not sure what that guy was doing there. I mean, it's just ridiculous what some of these guys think that, that they can do or think that they, you know, are whatever. I mean, these guys were were rambunctious in this race for sure. I, I had a good path at the start if you guys want to go back and check it out. It was really good. And then uh, ended up not actually being, uh, like, so free. And I think it is just because I ended up jumping over that. So to begin with, it is all my fault. But there was still some dumb times where it's kind of like, what are you doing? And uh, you'll definitely see glimpses of that in this video for sure. In this race, uh, I try to race my heart out. I mean, I was making time up and then someone would make an, a mistake. And I'm not going to put every single mistake on the guy in front of me. But a lot, a majority of them came from, you know, the people in front of me for sure. Uh, right here, I mean, it's just a group of Hondas. I was looking to pass. I ended up uh, getting past a, a couple and then uh right here someone went down luckily didn't go down and then this guy kind of snuck up my inside took me by surprise went up and then uh i think i got lucky with this one right here yeah uh well it's not really lucky it's just knowing the game and how it works and uh luckily not going down in the process because of the way that you handled it so uh i mean if you don't react that quick with the the sit and stand button you might not be there um some guys were going for those quads and whatnot 
And I ended up taking this line right here. Kind of got shut out there by a Mr. GLO. Is that Glow from uh, System Decal? Uh, he, I don't know. He's probably like a qualify warrior. He wasn't really, I mean, he's very fast. Don't get me wrong. And then this is just all my mistake for sure. I, I don't know if that came from the stick drift, but it's definitely, I, had, I hadn't done that. And then I met, let uh, Mr. Whatever have some room. Um, I couldn't read his name, but yeah, he, I let him have a little bit of room. He could have his time, make his pass. I was fine with it because most of these guys end up making mistakes anyways. And, uh, I feel like if I were in that top six, uh, pack, I would definitely have a chance because of just how consistent I felt. I saw that cross jump coming. So I did check up a bit there, but, uh, I mean, these guys corner speed was, I mean, unlike anything I've seen. So definitely something I got to work on is my E road, which I thought got way better this past week along with uh, corner speed that just needs to. And then, oh my God, don't even get me started with Squirrely right there. Uh, I mean, I DM'd him after the race and kind of told him. Uh, I, we shared some kind words. Uh, it was all nice. We all resolved it. You know you know what I'm saying? Like, I didn't say anything bad. I can't say uh, <clears throat> what I said on YouTube, though. It was just too nice. It's too grateful. You guys can't think I'm that big of a softy. So ended up doing whatever. And then uh, a couple of bad mistakes led up to me realizing that I had uh, music on. And then this right here was kind of bizarre. Uh, I feel like guys just don't look behind them. And I mean, they really shouldn't. I mean, you're in an LCQ this far back, just put your head down and whatnot and take whatever lines fastest. And then I ended up not sitting or I was sitting down right there instead of standing up cost me a lot of time. Um, yeah, I definitely was trying to charge. You guys, sound kicks on. Oh my just a second. God. And I've been listening to music this whole time. And you hear me say, I've been listening to music this whole time. So you guys will have sound back for the uh, the rest of the video. Uh, not that it really helps. Uh, I did almost get in this, this uh, guy's way, which I was pretty sorry about. Went for this triple, like an absolute dumbo. Just trying to follow the guy in front of me. Didn't really work out. And then here I got really pissed. I mean, I was already so furious with uh, how things had gone, especially with Squirrely. And um, I think Squirrely ended up going down again. I had speed on that Dragon's Back all day. And then here's Mr. Squirrely hopping up in my line. Checked up like right there when I stood up because I didn't know what to expect. I didn't know if I was going to lag so into him. These stupid and then people. I checked up in the beginning because I thought this guy was going to white me. And then I ended up, uh, you know, just listening to common inspirational words from me because, you know, I'm up all about those stupid people. <laughs> um I was checking up and then I ended up just sending it at the end and kind of threw off my rhythm through there. I know I can't blame that all on him. That is majority on me, but in anticipation and the lack of anticipation I had there, for sure, it's not all the other guy's fault, but I feel like um, it's really hard to dictate with some of these guys ping and whatnot. And Squirrely just hops right back up in the main line. Uh, I wanted to cross jump in there, but I kind of pulled out at the last second and then he went over. I mean, I wanted to take him out bad, but I mean, I didn't really have to make the mistake yeah, for him. Goes down right in front of me. Nothing I can do. I land straight on his his bike and nothing. I mean, nothing I can do. Absolutely ridiculous. I hate watching this race back the third time doing it. I edited this video once. Uh, file wasn't good. So I'm doing it again. But, um, yeah, it's... I'm so... What is It's happening? not great. Ended up pulling off a front flip right there. I mean, I was not making this many mistakes in the whoops uh, during qualifying or during, uh, you know, just testing the three and a half hours before this race. But what I want to really take out of the night was I was horrible during qualifying and there's that. <laughs> I'm so done. Um, but one thing I did want to emphasize on, I thought I had a horrible lap and that there's no way I was qualifying. Ended up qualifying with uh, 0.2 seconds to spare when I could have gone 0.5 seconds faster as well. And then Squirrely, you'll never guess, pops up the inside, hops right up into the main line. Uh, I wanted to take him out here as well. Ended up not. Oh my God. Uh, this is close to the end of the video, so make sure to uh, consider leaving a like and subscribing. I was pretty much done at this point, and then uh, there was a rut. You know how sometimes through the whoops, if enough guys ride through them, it was enough. So, kind of happened here. Yeah, that's all for me, folks.